up man um yeah that was me lip syncing to something like you asked um so about the lip syncing thing and how you put your song put that song in the video when you said let's not use copyrighted stuff in these videos <laughs> what you meant was let's all right uh i don't agree with what you said about i'm man but i'm gonna stop talking about it because it's been too long and it's stupid you're right about the novella term making sense within the twilight world um, you beat me with infallible logic. <laughs> uh, your roof was boring, but the idea was good, so next time film your cat or some rain or something. You water your, You said you can take your plants down and water them. What, and then put back the wet plants on top of your TV? Or are they there because you haven't watered them yet? Because they should be dead. My resurrection plant is alive and well. It is in a pot. It's green. Everything's working. It's not dying. Very proud of myself for keeping it alive so long like a few days and if it does die because I forget to water it all I have to do is put it back in water for a day and it comes back to life <laughs> it's amazing I'm so happy I don't want to call it Roger I don't want to call it Marvin which is what my friend Charlotte suggested Charlotte is my video stalker and she was very keen on me telling you that she said in my last video I look like a tooth and to prove that to you I took a photo of it I already want to go and see Inception and I will see it with you. I watched Shutter Island like you suggested and it was really really cool. I don't remember if I already said that to you in real life. Good luck with being a writer. I like your attitude. It's the same with me. Like People laugh at philosophy and say that won't get you a job and stuff but I like philosophy. Most of the hobbies I've got, if not all of them, and the interests, I like because of the elements of philosophy within them. So philosophy just makes the most sense to me to study. Um, is that everything? I bought a load of books. I bought a load of books the other day in Boulders, which is why I should not be allowed near bookshops when I've got exams to do. I'm reading this one called The Moneyless Man, right? Which is about this guy that gave up money for a while, like a year. I, he talks about the community type thing as well. Like he's doing it on his own, on his own, so obviously it's harder. But he talks about how he wants to, like, he goes on every publicity thing that people will throw at him because he wants to spread the message about it and he wants more people to do it and stuff. It's really interesting. You might like it. I don't know. Because we were talking about that community thing before, and it's kind of like that. I swear, this book could have been written by you. Seven Days consists of seven original cutting-edge stories depicting life from very different angles. Seven, fascinates, seven fascinating authors each delve into the mind of a character for a single day, offering something that every reader will relate to. Carefully selected, each story provides an insight from a very different perspective, and together they weave a powerful and gritty portrait of human experience. A unique cross between the novel and the short story, blah blah blah. It's, it's your book! Other than that, I am into Kanto in Pokemon Gold now. I've almost clocked up 50 hours. The theme music is like, like a remix of the original Kanto battle music, which has made me so happy. Listen. There you go. That's what I was waiting for. <laughs> it's remix and it's got weird bits in it, but it's like, oh my god! makes you want to mosh, which is really strange. I'm sure you understand. For your next video, I want you to make a haiku. I'm going to put a link in the downstairs area, the basement, <laughs> where you can learn how to make a haiku if you don't know already. It can be about anything you want. Make a haiku for next week. I will see you maybe tomorrow, maybe Friday, but soon. Goodbye.
That was way too much fun.